Welcome back for more reptiles, archery, engineering. Ladies and gents, have fun and please enjoy. Hey ladies and gents, this is Scorpion here yeah, right now. I just, now, uh, if my phone turns on. Uh, 8 minutes past 7 in the morning. Right now, Shimmy's awake. He's heads up. I kept the heat mat on last night because drop below freezing is the rain. It's supposed to keep warm. Nah, it's freaking cold. Hey, me boy. How's my big boy going, hey? How you doing? That's my boy. That's my boy. That's my oldest boy. That's my big boy. Hey, baby boy. Snappy. You want to stay in the warm? Okay. So, yeah, my boys woke up a little bit earlier. It's only eight, uh, nine minutes, ten minutes past seven in the morning. Plus, the heat mat wasn't the heat mat was on last night as well, so yeah, these uh, these months I need to keep the heat mat on because it's cold. And this is only, this is only the first month of winter, but the second and third. I need the heat mount on too as well, so plus I need the oh fuck um power needs to be cut off today and that absolutely fucking sucks they gotta cut the power off today between nine o'clock and about three o'clock today so, in one of those times, uh, they will shut the power off, change the power lines to brand new wires, and then they'll turn on, turn on the power. So, eh, yeah, it's one of those fucking things. Uh, but, yeah, I put my series on to be sold this is the coffee from yesterday why well, taste weed well I left it on the table yesterday afternoon helping my dad it um yeah. So right now I'm watching Tyne on. He's got a new emu. He's got a new emu on the ranch. And he said, will it work out? Because he's got two emus what he brought the first time. But this new one, he doesn't know whether it will work out to be friends or they will kill e kill each other. Don't know. But, you know, like, eh, I have to watch it. I gotta help my dad with the generator. If I drain the tank first. Yeah, yeah drain the tank of fuel and then. Yeah, me and my dad got another dud. Uh, another dud generator. Not good. Yeah, it's supposed to be the top range generators where it powers two houses at once bullshit so right now I'm going to help my dad to drain the oil and drain the tank I am not going to fork another fuel canister of fuel to fill up the bloody generator because oh my fucking god uh, how big is that tank? Fuck. So right now, I'll see you guys at Archery till then. I'm going to help my dad this morning to put the generator on the 
in the car and then he'll take it to the shop where he brought it and get a new one that is working so hopefully so I'll see you guys at archery alright ladies and gents it is now 8.42 they gotta shut down the power lines right now shut down the power then they gotta replace it with thick wire so yeah I got out there just in time but I had to turn off the Bit of Dragon's Light and heat lamp, a heat mat to allow them to do their job. So, yeah. So, right now, let's go on the field. My friend Ian's back. Yay! <laughs> but, let's see how well he is. So, let's go on there. Let's go on the field. Let's have some fun. Okay, I'm gonna practice. My friend Ian's back. Oh, well, that's good. Take your time, Michael. Take your time. Yep. That's better.
Alright, now I count the numbers. Yes, Michael, fucking yes. <laughs> you took your time and look where it went. I can have about four seconds slow in my head. Yeah, and mate, shot. it's just secret. The secret's in taking your time, okay? <laughs> yep. Good shoot, Michael. Good shoot. I'll get up here every time I see you shooting fast, okay?
know you can do it. The only problem is, is you. You who wants to get a pot. But this is easy. No pain, no gain. I've got all the faith in you, mate. Mm -hmm. I know you can do it. Yep. You've just got to convince yourself that you can. The slower you go, the more it changes down. There is a point where you're too slow, but you've got to work that out. Mm. Okay. Flame is... That's it. Alright. Now it's back in the bag. Don't let go until that, uh, that, that thing's right on the centre and staying there. It's got to stay on the centre. Yep. Or close to it. Better shot. In line and just, just a little bit high, but good shot. You drop your arm. When you release, you drop your arm. Yeah. Keep it straight out. All right. Have another one, mate. While you correct the mistake. That was almost six oh, arrows. Right. <laughs> Keep the bow up until the arrow hits, okay? Right here? Yep. You're shooting much better, Michael. Yeah. Ah, I'm, I'm pretty good at it.
more. That's freaking good. Thirty meters. That's the one. Second row. Do me a favor. Yeah. Go online. Check your uh, uh, bow that it's not slanted. Mm. Now your arrows are all on one side. Yeah. That means you're slanting the bow this way. The only time you do that is when the hill's sleeping that way, sleeping that way. So correct yourself by checking. You haven't got a level on this, have you? No. So check your bow that it's upright. Oh, yeah. If you go this way, that's where your arrows are going. It doesn't matter how good you shoot, mm. that's where they're going to go. So check your bow that is straight up and down. Most compound shooters have got a level on here. Yeah. And they check the level. Mm. Okay? So just check it this time and see if it works for you. Just check your, your bow. Bit better. Yeah. Mine doesn't. Mine doesn't have a, a level on it. Give it another one. See if you can. Get, just just before you you start to aim, check that the bow is up straight up and down. Yeah. And then aim. Check your bow, just where you are. Check your bow that's up and down. Now aim. Beautiful. Look out where you've come to. Yeah. You're now right above the center. You've got a better chance of getting the center than over on the side, haven't you? Yeah. Good stuff. 
reason I tell you that is because I'm shooting with no sights. Mm. So if my bow is, is slanted, that's where the arrows go. Yep. Yeah, that's right there. Oh, 
All right, that was round three. Okay. Look what happens when you concentrate on your level. Yeah. See my arrows? Look. Yeah. Straight up and down. Very good shooting, Michael. You're getting better, buddy. A couple of stupid ones, but the rest is wood. Green balloon down. Huh. That's not bad. That's not bad at all. Round four now.
check your bow first. Nice line. Probably didn't give it enough strength back. Mm. Same strength. Yeah. Pretty good shooting, Michael. <laughs> Go for it, mate. Okay. okay. Um. Round five. Okay. Round five here. I want to down there.
Much better. Keep that bow straight up and down. Yeah. Round five. Okay. Okay. Cockatoos. Okay, mark it down now. Uh, Thirteen, eighty-nine, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three. Wait. 13, 18, 19, 20, 21, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40. That's a 40. 16, 17, 8, 9, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40, 41, 42, 43. Hey, Jim! How are we doing? Guess who's back? I know, I see his car. <laughs> He's doing well down there, shooting away. <laughs> yeah. I'm just counting my points right now, Jim. So far, I only got one zero. Only got one zero. Good morning, Jim. How you going, man? Nine, six, ten, oh. nine, twenty, twenty. Oh, twenty, twenty. Only a little brisk. Nice to slip in, did you? Oh yes. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen. 45. I need a cuppa. <laughs> you, you need a cuppa? <laughs> okay. I didn't think it could be that bad. <laughs> okay. That's only one minute past ten. Yeah, I know. What time did you think it was? 
I don't know about 951 and 959, but yeah, time's going slow for me. All right, 36, 40. Better, though. <laughs> Two or nine. Hey, Lucky! Ian's back. Yeah. Hello, Jimmy. How you going, Lucky? Good, mate. Good. How are you? Pretty good, honey. It's a little bit cool. It is. But I've got my jumper and my vest on. <laughs> and I've got a coat in the car if I need it. <laughs> oh, I don't think you'll need the coat. I, no. think, you'll be, I think you'll be shedding. I think I'll be right. What's happened here? All the bloody... Come to say thank you for that card. Oh, that's right. We were crook and that did the wonders yeah. for us. Yeah, how are you, mate? Thank you, I appreciate it. Good yeah. mob again, good mob of blokes. How was the trip? Uh, successful. Yeah, yeah. Um, but I found the, the Hall of Fame boring. Did you? Oh, when they induct somebody, I come up representing you. So I yeah. go up to the microphone, I'm there for half an hour telling them what a great guy you are. Yeah. Then when I finish, you go up to the microphone and tell them how good a good guy you are. <laughs> Three quarters an hour to an hour to a hour and a half. Oh my God. Each person. Jesus And you go. Yeah. I went to sleep. Did you? Yeah, right in the front and the, oh, I'm on table number one which is right at the front. Yeah, yeah. And stand across me is TJ, uh, TJ Conrad's and a couple of the officials. Yeah. They look at me and I'm going. Yeah. <laughs> Boring as batch. Yeah. Less tall, yeah. more pictorial. If we're going to take your thing, we want to show you winning the championships showing you the factory, your clubhouse, yeah. whatever it is, yeah. and how you achieved your gig. Well, the, videos, well, shooting, well, the idea is, my, I, I went to Polo, I told him, I said that was a first event for me. In the now, it's great for here and everybody's oh, there. Years. Entertain them, certainly, yeah. but in 10 years' mm. time, there's the yeah. have some history to pull yeah. out. Okay. Yeah. 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 Not hard to do. Oh yeah, we had a great time, Ben and I. We yeah. Shook hands and cuddled every sheeter I could find. Yeah. <laughs> oh but, yeah. You know, that's the way oh yeah. Like we knew. Big family. We knew yeah. what he was interested in. When you're strange, you just tend to sit behind your seat like this, you know. Yeah. yeah. But when you've been there that many, oh shit! Yeah. Haven't seen you for a while, mate. Yeah. Now, yeah. Oh, it's <laughs> big difference, yeah. mate. They accept. Oh, it. good <laughs> on you, mate. <laughs> Don't buy me, Jim. You both grab my jacket. <laughs> hey, hey Daryl. Daryl Pace, the best celebrated oh, archer in America. Yeah. Okay, Dad said, Oh, how are you? How are you, mate? Yeah. yeah. Or, or they're John. Just, they're just people, aren't they? They've done great things. They all sit down to go to the toilet. Yeah. 
Yeah, they do. You know that? And they fart too. Yeah. <laughs> they do. <laughs> oh, yeah. They do. I thought it was that's me. A that's a prize. I thought it was only me. <laughs> but, yeah, but that's that's it. I mean, yeah, yeah. Um, Ben had the time. He, he said to me, oh, I'm just coming over to to keep you together, make sure you get there safe, and I'll just bet on the back. Yeah. When I got over there, oh, I introduced him to everybody, and they're up cuddling him, and they're yeah. there's all the top hunters are over. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, Randy. Oh, yeah. how are you? You know, Tom, Tom. You know, he's yeah. so he he's uh, he's number one in Australia, but he's also rising up through the international ranks. So now the Americans are grabbing hold of him, and they love him. Yeah. So he said to me when I come home, I said, no, "I'm not going back." Yeah. I'm not going back. I mean, I, I couldn't stand through another one and a half hours of each person. No, no. Like that. <laughs> I'd probably stand up and say, yeah, <laughs> sit down. Yeah. So uh, Ben said, I'll keep an open mind. But the seven yeah. way. Yeah. You might do that. Yeah, they lift their game. I think you're Mate, trying to show me things. I'm not bullshit. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> the only thing that's ever come from Bathurst yeah, yeah. made us feel like we were part of the community. And Rome and I just. Yeah. We've got it up on the, as he knows, we've got it up on the sideboard. That was bloody Martin, though. Yeah, but I yeah. mean... I know, we all... We're, yeah, but he's all kind and that's amazing. Yeah, he's a very yeah. kind person, Martin. Yeah, we've got to do something for him before oh. Christmas. Yeah. We'll, we'll shock him. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Well, that bloody Jim. Give us your bow. <laughs> oh, sorry. I, 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 I knew you wanted that. That's a, that's a bloody neat... Um, yeah, it's working. It's working. Oh, yeah. They're so standing up, up straight up and down. Oh. Yeah. Um, yeah. They are a rash, those bloody fans. Jim yeah. won the competition in Wollongong. Yeah, I know, but they uh, they heard he was coming and said, oh, we'll look after him, he'll come back then. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no, I'm proud of you, mate. That's beautiful. One of the owls got up, the Baffist owls. Oh, yeah, it's, it's, yeah. it's well... It's well... Oh, it's and that's adjustable. I still say you really need a longer one, but that's up to you. You can have that one any time you want it and shoot it. If you look at any of the target archers, they're, they're that long. I've got one of them. Hey? I've got one you can have. I don't like but, it. Mate, you should experiment with them. You know, and... and Do you want it, Jim? Honestly, it's just in the bloody box at home. I never use it. You can drag a horse to water, but you can't make the bastard drink. You know, well, I can give it to you. Though. <laughs> you can use it as a paper and fire or whatever you like. Oh, yeah, but you know, to look at what the other people are doing. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. The bear bowers use that. Yeah. Bear bowers are only allowed 300 millimetres. Yeah, I've got a little short one. And they get a tape out and they go, hmm. Oh, $310. <laughs> mm. Yeah, well, mine's about... No, that's fish bill, yeah. yeah. It's, a, it's a tad... No, uh, this is what I'm talking about, yeah. the length of your... Oh, yeah. 300 millimetres. That's all I'm allowed. Yeah. Mine's made up of bits and pieces. Is it? Yeah, well, mine. You reckon that one's too long, do you? There, so you you know what I'd love to do is take a mob of yours down to the uh, 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 the owls, I'm talking about the Baffist owls, yeah, yeah, the yeah. night shooters, down to the state championship, fields championships in Wollongong in September. Well Would you come, Lockie? I'd ride. I'd want to go the day before though. I wouldn't want to drive down the Friday No, night I, night. I did that. Don't do it. No. Go down Friday night, stay the night. Yeah. Saturday night, stay the night. Yeah. You have to make a decision whether you want to come home on the Sunday night. I'd probably go home on Sunday. But I, I, I would thoroughly recommend don't do it. Go drive down in the morning because no. it kills you. Yeah. Might be alright for you, but... No, well, it wouldn't be any good for me. I wouldn't drive. No. It spoils the whole bloody. Like you can have a nice weekend with friends and shoes and stuff like that, or you can be completely fucked. Yeah, yeah. well, <laughs> I got, uh, we left here, I never got sleep the two nights before. Then I got up at five o'clock or four o'clock or something. By the time I got 
breakfast for Rome and washed up and got yeah. the car already, blah, blah, blah. blah. Um, then we drive down and we got lost in bloody uh, Campbelltown. Yeah. Because yeah. I haven't got an up-to-date navigator yeah. and there's no signs. No. no nothing tells you anywhere. No, no. So they kept sending, sending me back to Sydney. Anyhow, to, <laughs> to, when we got down there, finally got down there, it was 9.15. By the time I got Roma down to the canteen, she wanted to go to the toilet. And yeah. So down to the canteen and put her there and fixed her up. The practice session was over. <laughs> so then I, I then had to get my gear. And then I grabbed a cup of coffee and an egg burger. Yeah. And by quarter to ten, oh, you better have your bow inspection. So I go over and get the bow inspection. Yeah. And then... Quarter to ten, they started to. Good day, Lucky. How are you, mate? Oh, good, mate. How are you, Lucky? They uh, they walk out to the field race. Yeah. So from ten o'clock yeah. until half past two, yeah. we never stopped for lunch. You kept. Well, I was rat shit. Yeah. You'd be rat shit when you started. <laughs> yeah, I was, but I was rat shit when I was finished. At the end of the couple of targets, I could hardly pull them over. Yeah. That's no fun. I don't want to do that. No, that's why I'm advising you. And the big thing about it, you've got to look at the cost. The cost of the petrol down. Yeah. Too much accommodation. Now, we're looking at accommodation. The cheapest I can get is, at this stage is 160. Yeah. If you go 140, it's way, it's about 10 k's out of town. Yeah, So 180, 160 will put you down into Fig Tree, which is. Yeah. Not far from thing. We usually stay there, but it's gone up to 180. Yeah, right. So we've got to look on the internet, see if we can get it at 160. Then that's 320 plus your petrol. Yeah. Starting to get. Then you've got uh, 60 dollars for two days. Yeah. Or 70 dollars. 70 dollars for two days. So you're looking at six or eight hundred dollars. Yeah. yeah. So you've got to ask yourself. You get a medal and a certificate if you win. Yeah. And they kick up the bum if you don't. Yeah. So, it might be, it might be a thing. But uh, I reckon you'd do well, and I reckon he'd go well. And oh, he yeah. already does well. He's a champion. 70 over 70 champion. Oh, we'd soon bring him down to earth with that bloody night shoot, mate. We'll fix his. We'll 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 I want to shoot a bit better than we shoot there. <laughs> <laughs> I'll have to improve myself. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know, he. No, that might be fun. Yeah, we might do that. But anyhow, give it, what I'm saying is, yeah. what I'm doing now, is I'm actually getting my distances. Yeah. Because I got me bow restrung. Yeah. And uh, where is that there? All restrung, so he's got no distances now. Yeah. So he's, uh, he's tuned the bow. Yeah. And you have to figure out all my distances I've got down there. Oh, you've got them there? Yeah. I've got them up here. Well, in, in uh, Bevo, you're not allowed to have anything written down. No, but I, I'm like science. Yeah. yeah. So, so that's at 40 now, is it? Is that 40? That's at 40, what he's got. Yeah. So 40 for me, down there, 4.85. So, you can use my target, mate, because yep. I only want to go and do 60 and then I'm going home. Yep. So, help yourself, mate. Yeah, mate, I... Uh, I thank you for that card. It made us part of the community after <laughs> 10 years. <laughs> well, you break an arrow. And this is the boy who's been shooting well this morning. You uh, watch uh, it, boy. He's after you. He's <laughs> after you. Yeah. Get up him. Get up him. Yeah. <laughs> Don't let that bloody thing get away with me. Eat your cranky little, eh? <laughs> <laughs> little shit, this fella. <laughs> nah. There you go. <laughs> Uh, don't need it, Jim. <laughs> got one from the yes, arrow that exactly. broke. It is, yeah. Oh, well, you've got to, <laughs> I hope it's the right size for one. Is it? Um, yeah. It's a pretty long head. I got the, the bullet head. Yeah, but, 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 but I mean, yeah, you're quite welcome to it, mate. 
Yes, okay. I told you I had it and I was bringing it up. <laughs> yeah. But he kept on ignoring me, didn't he? No, he I dare not. He, he, I did he, not he, even he, ignore you. No, he's <laughs> bloody rude, isn't he? Rude. No, I, I did not even oh, ignore I, you, I, Jim. I got my TV. Oh, you got it, did you? Yeah. I made it mine up an orange, had one. Ah. His mother wouldn't get rid of anything. And it's sitting in the kitchen. And, uh, and he said, oh no, you can have that, so, and it works, so, all done. Uh, Cost me nothing. Even better. Yeah, even better, yeah. Only to trip up to Orange. Yeah, <laughs> well, it's nice to visit anyway. Uh, That's it. <laughs> That's a long shot, I don't know whether I can make that. Yep. 40 metres, I suppose I can. It's 40 now. Yeah, well he, well, 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 he hasn't hit the target yet. I've seen him hit it. That's a lie. <laughs> now, 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 don't bullshit, Jim. That's a lie. <laughs> you, you stop your skiting there. <laughs> <laughs> I saw him hit it. Jim, now, bu uh, now you're bushing now. Eh? <laughs> I'm trying to do the 40 metres so I can get back to the 45. Whoa, look at that. That's a nine. <laughs> hey. Hey, who, 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 who shot that? Hey, who, that's who, Locky. Who, 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 who was it? Locky, not you. <laughs> <laughs> that's a fluke. Oh, you it. Those red seven. Yeah. <laughs> well, you, 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 you do yourself very really good, Lucky. Really good, lucky. I did all right. Oh, fuck off. Oh. <laughs> we did the wood. I don't need to. <coughs> I'll be too accurate for you lot.
shot for a couple of months and I've got my bow restrung so I've got no distances so I've got to find out what the distance is 50. Uh, I'll give it a couple of more shots and then I'll uh, you put it whatever you want and I'll shoot it. I'm going back to 60. Yeah. That all right? Okay, six so is twelve, fifteen, sixteen. Shit. Okay. Morning. Morning, Troy. <laughs> Troy. Morning. How you doing? How you going? Good. Going well. <laughs> I 
Very nice. Yep. I, I, I sort of you were doing this. Peaking. So I should have held my arrow up until it hit. You were doing this. Yeah. That's why you're getting scattered arrows. You're not checking your line here above either. Yeah. Yeah. You've got to beat this boat. Yeah. He's trying to organize something there. What's this I hear? Oh, just watch Logan shoot. Yeah. What's this? What's this idea? You're trying to organise something. Yes. Um, yeah. Like we're a load of interest, but I'd like to get the night owls. Who do I call them? The night owls. Go down and have a go at the state field championships in September. Yeah. Okay. About the 17th and 18th is $70. G'day, Troy. How you doing? I've got the FOS machine going. Anyone else need it? Me? No. Uh, I, can't, I can't scan my yeah. card because I've got so the wall. Oh, okay. Me. That's right. Me. $70 yeah. to go in for both days or $40 for one day. So if you're going down my advice is go down Friday night. They start, registration starts from 7.30 in the morning. It means you've got to go there and sign the book to say you're there. Bow inspections is from 8.30. You've got to get your bow and everything checked. Uh, practice starts at 8.30. And stops around about 9.30. Uh, musters at, uh, I think, quarter to 10 or, or half past 8. And then they start shooting at 10 o'clock. <laughs> but they don't finish until about half oh, past two. No. Uh, on both days. Uh, on both days. Uh, yes, yes, on both days. Walking. Where's the place? It's Illawarra. Now I just, I just shed it all. My, my, my big stuff that I had on. Right, yeah, <laughs> I shed it. Road, and then you come down us the archeries just below the scout camp or the guide camp. Thing, and then the, the main wool and gold is over here. Holy Jesus, eh? Yeah, I know when they're not even started already into the chips. <laughs> it's uh, they've got a good clubhouse, probably the best field range in Australia. Yeah, and uh, the people are fantastic, the, the club is fantastic. You'll have a good time. Your practice is on a target like this, so but it's not that like we were shooting in there. It's not like that. No, no indoor. No. no. But it's not um, probably needed for way down Oh, but you can shoot at any distance. They've got different distances for you to shoot at. Yeah. And uh, what they do is they've got little fence, fence areas. Yeah. So if you want to shoot 60 metres, <laughs> it's over there. If you want to shoot 50 metres, it's in the next paddock. Right. And so yeah. the same as this, about the same width as this. Yeah. But they've got it cut off into different panels so that you can shoot in each whatever distance you want. So if you say, oh, I want to shoot a 60, go and say, oh, bugger it, I'll go back to 30 yeah. or 20 or whatever it is. And you say you can, you can swap and do whatever you like. So you go for the two days? Um, I'd like to. Um, okay. uh, Roman's agreed to do it. Um, three. What bothers me is the bloody cost of everything, you know. That's, uh, I'm, I would like to go for, I'm setting my target at yes, I'm going. Yeah. The accommodation all this thing cheap Well, um, I looked online, and of course online you've got to, every through agencies are yeah, booking and yeah, that. Yeah. And you know, Tobago, I'll tell you, you can get it for $150 yeah, yeah. and when you get there, oh no mate, that's during the week. Yeah, it's now $190, you know, so if you do book, um, I'd ring the place and book thing, and book in advance, you've got it seven days for cancel if you don't, no, there's no cost in cancelling, but the one I'm, uh, it's called, um, I think it's Solomon Inn, it's in Fig Tree, it's a very good little motel. We stay there because it's not very far up to the oh, up to the you range. Close, yeah. But if you stay in the middle of the town, it's, uh, it's better yeah, hotels oh, yeah, and that. No, but, yeah. Yeah. 
So yeah, tree. my choice is probably, I looked at the different ones, there's a 140 and 145, 150, 160, yeah, yeah. but they're 10 k's from the Wollongong. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So yeah, yeah. you've got a too far to come, you've got to spend your money in petrol. It's a big tree. Eh? What's it called? At Fig Tree? At Fig Sol Tree, it's the Sol Solomon, Solomon, Solomon Inn. Yeah. At Fig Tree, but I'll, I'll get all the information for yeah, the night owls yeah, yeah, and, yeah. and then uh, yeah. if you just want to go, we'll go as a... Well, I'm happy if it's this a nice group of us. Yeah, it'd be yeah. nice to have a, a, you know, we'd go down and... The old night owls, anyhow. What do you reckon, Jim? I don't care what the rest of them are. I'll go. Yeah, I'm quite prepared. Yeah, would you go? How, what do you reckon, Rocky? 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 Maybe. Rocky. Maybe. <laughs> yeah, well, it's, uh, you've only got a certain, from our point of view, we've only got a couple of years to go and we're finished. So. Yeah. Yeah, you could drop dead any day. No, no, no. Maybe. Didn't your mum tell you it's rude to point? No. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know why I'm standing between you two blokes. <laughs> They'll say yeah, maybe. Yeah, it's a big red and Jim. No, it'll be good to... Count me in, count Jim in, and yeah. whoever else you can rustle up. Yeah, oh, well, it, I haven't spoken to Logan, he might, but he'd probably get out of the club, so I don't know. So it's up to the... But it'd be good to just get us, uh, we have a few laughs. And... Oh, yeah. Go to the club tonight. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. So you can buy a breakfast at the club from 7.30. Oh, yeah, yeah. So they've got good egg burgers and yeah, stuff like yeah, that if you want it, and coffee yeah, and tea. Yeah, yeah, and yeah. You can buy lunch there. I think uh, lunch is... Uh, is supplied with your uh, fee. What did you shoot? Well, what if we go down the night before? Oh, I'm going down on the Friday, well, Friday afternoon. Morning, 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 morning. We can start fresh in the morning, eh? Yeah. Morning. Stay yeah. over Saturday night. Yeah. Oh, yeah, I went down. I tried to save money and it killed me. No, I was the distance. Go down Friday night. It hit the seven. Come home after Saturday afternoon. I'm going down Friday lunchtime. Let's go out to the rain, probably have a couple of shots if anybody's there. What can't we just do it overnight? You want to stay two nights? No, I'm staying two nights. Oh, you're staying two nights. Yeah, you can stay one day, yeah, you can yeah. shoot one day and come home. Mm -hmm. That costs you $40. Yeah. Yeah. So you can go Friday night yep. and then come home Saturday night. But I'm going to stay for the two days because it's a state championship. <coughs> so you could just shoot 50, 50 metres all day long. No, you're shooting field. You've got to shoot state, state field. You've got to shoot different distances. Yeah. Like 50 stay on one. No. Like eight. On the camera? No, it's... it's uh, up here you've got, you've got 5 metres, 10 metres, 15, 20, 25, 30. 35, 40, 50, and if you're using sights, 60, 60 metres, that's field. So this target might be 50 metres, the first target on, on their course is 50 metres. Right, but there's three pegs, there's a, a red peg, a, a blue peg, and then a yellow peg. Now you're shooting sighted uh, compound, so you'll shoot at every distance that has a red peg. So your furthest distance will be 60 metres. Too far. I can't shoot. He's just shooting. Too far. That's, that's the extent, 40 metres for me. Um, 60 metres I'd be up in the air. Yeah, longbow, longbow and uh, longbow and juniors and that shoot at the yellow peg. I don't think Jim will make 60 metres. And then the red peg no, is for sided, sided, uh, on it. Yeah, red peg is for sided uh, uh, recurvers and bare bowers. So I'm, I'm shooting on the blue peg. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah I couldn't shoot something. I wouldn't try. What about this one we're going to go to Penrith? 
He'd shoot like we do here. Well, Steve was saying, he'd go to Penguin and shoot. Good indoor. Yeah. You can. I'm going to that. I'm, if yeah. I'm going to spend the money, I'm going to yeah. something that I can. But you know about this one at Penguin? What, the range? Yeah, the indoor shoot. I have it. Hey, no, it's all booked out. Oh, it's booked out? Oh, yeah. Ask, ask Jim. He tried to get in. Oh, okay. Oh. At Penrith, it's not at Penrith, it's at another place out of Penrith, that's where I went a couple of years ago. It's booked out. Oh yeah, it's it only have certain... Once a year, isn't it? Well, each club, instead of the society running one big shoot, they leave it to each club. <coughs> and the club, the club, uh, so Penrith, don't shoot at Penrith, they've got a little, little indoor centre out at, uh, I forget the name of the place. Jim, what's that uh, Penrith shooting uh, venue, indoor? Yorkshire or something, what's it called? Oh, I'm damned if I know, Ian. You, had a, you went and had a go there and you tried to get in it and they're booked out, aren't they? Yeah, it's not Yorkshire, it's not Wilberforce. Not good. Wilberforce. It's only a little hall. Yeah, yeah. Well, it's so small they can't fit many in Well, we tried to book in last Monday. Was it last Monday? I think it was last Monday. And they took that chat on the six. Well, I explained to you, explained to you, you've only got 10 Round people four. shooting across it. Yeah. And you've got to shoot 300 arrows. Oh, yeah. There's not much there. It takes a long time to get so, to they have about three, three different, or three or four ships during the day, yeah, yeah, yeah. and that's it. Oh. So, four if there's four ships, that's forty archers. That's yeah. all they're doing each day. Yeah. Yeah. So everybody wants to be in it because this the next one is down at bloody Coffs Harbour or somewhere, yeah, yeah. Port Macquarie, or yeah. Canberra. But I don't know why the club doesn't use this indoor centre out here and run their own. So what date in September is it? It's in July. No, no, yeah, no, 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 so you've got two shoots. You've got the South Coast Field, which is the 17th and 18th of August, or you go to the 18th, 17th, 18th of uh, September, and that's the State Field, New South Wales State Field Championships. That's the one I'm going. I just know in September we've got a gig booked in Cowra with the band. And it's around the 21st. A oh, what? A gig with the band on the oh, yeah. Shane and I and Steve, and Jeff, the bass player. <coughs> uh, we've got a gig overnight in Cowra on the 21st. Oh, that's good. So as long as it doesn't clash with that. Oh, it'd be close though, wouldn't it? I'm thinking, yeah. Back and then one day later you're yeah. on. Well, it's a be a Saturday night in Cowra. Actually, Lockie. I wouldn't have been Oh! You only Michael, have to fight against one or two targets. You see that? What? Yeah, oh, you hit the tip. The rest of 50 metres. Oh, fucking bits flying off everywhere. I'm at 50 metres. Yeah. What's me mate Troy up to? You've still got the rest of the rain. What a salvage some arrows. They're up close. I don't need it. Yeah, ice cream, mate, is the 5, 10, and 15. That's where you make up. Hey, Jim, <laughs> you, you want to see what, what happened? Someone like called Sunday to come. So what? Logan, Dan, uh, Logan, Dan, and Robert Wood. Did he? Yeah, even Troy did too. Logan and Dan and Robert Hood in one day. Well, he must be rich. <laughs> that's what Robin Hood did. They steal from the rich and give to the poor. Yeah, no, that's easy to do. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
That's why, that's why the compounders have a pin arrow here. It's a pin knob on it. Yeah. <laughs> Steve. Happy days. Off we went, eh? Till the wee hours. <laughs> get a wee little bit broken. Racking the shit up, though. That's the oh, yeah. that's, why get, that's why they get roadies, mate. Yeah, and load the box trailer up, you know, at midnight. <laughs> backing it up the driveway at 2 o'clock. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, <coughs> your last song you finished playing at 10.30, but you yeah. don't go back until 2.30. That's not for me. I think if I was younger, I'd do it. But you know, you hear about bands, you know, they don't get to bed till 2.30. That's what I'm saying. You, you, you play your last song at 10.30 at night, but you don't get to bed till 2.30. You're all the well, shit you've got to do afterwards. Or you up in your car, or you've got to put it in your shed, you know. Yeah. Like, yeah. Uh, for, for two hundred dollars, like yeah, you're right. going to take a love of it, really, because <laughs> yeah, exactly. that doesn't include all your tractors, it doesn't include the setup. That's right. You know yep. the, everything, and then yeah, so dismantling. It's it's tw tw twenty, 20 bucks an hour or something. Yeah, tw twenty, 20 bucks an hour. <laughs> twenty hours worth of work for yeah. like two hundred yeah. bucks. Yeah, but yeah. so you're doing it for the love of it, That's really. Right. Eh? That's what I say. <clears throat> you get it. It's all, it's all about the love of it until you yeah. start making it big. Yeah, that's what right. You start doing? making yeah. it big. And that doesn't happen real often. That's right. If you're playing music for the sake of trying to be rich and famous. <laughs> That's why I reckon the mic nights are the go, eh? Just, Just put your name down, play your tunes and get off, you know? It's off, yeah. <laughs> all the PA's there for you and everything. Okay. 15 minutes you packed yeah. up and done. Yeah, <laughs> so yeah. Yeah. It's a go. Yeah. I was watching uh, Britain's Got Talent. Mm hmm There's a girl on there, Sydney, Sydney Christmas. Yeah, okay. And she won uh, it this year. Yeah. <coughs> and the first first one she sung was Tomorrow, you know, from Annie. Tomorrow, tomorrow, there'll always be tomorrow, all that sort yeah, of thing. Yeah. And Simon Town said, they said, he hates that song. Yeah. <laughs> she said, the first, that's the first one I sung, I was only four, seven, and now yeah. she's 28. Yeah, yeah. And she just, incredible. Yeah, like, yeah, just, okay. she got the go on buzzer, yeah. and then she went on and she won the whole series. Oh, okay. Yeah. But it was sort of like when you see her, She's so funny and so good. It was like you can see a star being born. Yeah, because yeah. like she's just brilliant. This girl. She, they said Sydney. Yeah. Why my name's Chris? Sydney Christmas. And I said Sydney Christmas. That's an interesting name. Yeah. She said my middle name's even worse. What's your middle name? Mary. She said Sydney, Sydney Mary, Mary Christmas. Christmas. <laughs> Merry Christmas! Yeah. <laughs> I said, what was your mother thinking? Yeah. <laughs> no, no, I'm only joking, she said. Oh, oh, oh good on her, eh? Oh, good, good on her, eh? Yeah. She's, she's just worth watching. So she's going to be an upcoming star, isn't she? Yeah, yeah, she's one of the best singers I've ever heard. Yeah. Sydney Christmas. Sydney Christmas, yeah. yeah. That's her actual name. Yeah, Christmas. Sydney Christmas. Sydney Sydney Christmas. Christmas. She was Sydney. in a show in the West End nine years ago. It wasn't much good. But this time, she was just Brilliant. She's there with her two grandmothers. So yeah. It's fascinating. That's yeah. British got talent. Yeah, it's Britain. 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 Two, uh, 2024, if you see. Oh, yeah, so Sydney, this year. Sydney, yeah. yeah, Sydney Christmas, Golden <coughs> Buzzer, and you'll see a yeah, Sydney okay. that song. Oh, yeah. Sydney Christmas, Golden Buzzer. Yeah. What course is this? Hey? What course I, don't, is that? I don't know. It's been like that for a 
a couple of days. It's not the ground for an air raid. I reckon it'd be a bird. It, it looks like this sun's going over with an air raid. Yeah, yeah right. right. I reckon it'd be a bird looking for bloody... Um, yeah, digging worms. Getting, getting worms. Digging worms. Yeah. Yeah. Mm. 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 Probably those bloody mm. white cockatoos. Yeah, yeah, yeah destroyed them. Air raid in the forest. Mm. Tell me it's for lunch. Must be all the lunch must be done. Yeah. I don't know, I was hoping Kelly would come to the so she could sort out the yeah. 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 I'll have to ring Lynn, but she's another one that doesn't answer the phone, eh? Did you ever get hold of Lynn by telephone? Yeah, I always do, but I used oh. to work with her because she probably likes me and doesn't want to hear it. It's called cold it's called, it's called ID, mate. <laughs> can, you, can you ring her for me? I'm just doing I'm talking to him. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Can you? I think I've even seen her text messages, you know. Can you please ring me? I think. Yeah, yeah. It's a long way out. Yeah, it's a long way out. Yeah, yeah. Can you ring me? Yeah, yeah. Can you ring me? At least Kelly responded to me as he does into you, so... Yes. It's pretty even, isn't it? It's pretty even, isn't it? I only ever... I only ever... Say, oh, well, I'll see you. And I... Make sure I come up at, at, at what sort of times that I think they're... Now, I just have a thought about that. Gonna be if, here. if you can you can register as a new person, I wonder if you can pay that one. Uh, no, that's right. No, yeah. no, no. Yeah, because they want to know all the details. Oh, okay, yeah. 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 So that's no, that's no good. I, I, I think you go... I think there is a little sign in, in amongst... You know when you've done the first... Yeah. Little bit. Yeah, it's a re Then, uh, yeah, you go then into a renewal. The, yeah. the, there's another one yeah. there that you it would be there if you know how to oh, see it. Yeah. Right. Well, I clicked and on everything you can find, it's yeah. over the net. Yeah, it's just, I've done things like that. I'll have to ring Lynn and ask her. She'll and because uh, Lynn knows because mm. she was going, she's going to do mine for me yeah. this month. I think I'll just, I'll I'll just text Lynn and ask her when she's got a chance to ring me because yeah. I'm having trouble yeah. reading. Yeah, training day. It's <laughs> <laughs> training day. Yeah, how to, how to yeah they get their money off us. Yeah. <laughs> well, the boys are going to the full distance. Numbers up. Are you finished your answer, Jeff? Yeah. Has Pete's been coming? He yes. up. Yeah, every yeah. second week. Every second, because he goes yeah. to the gun club. Yeah. 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 You want to buy his state title one for his gun club? There we go. Well, I mean, yeah, if you've got a license, obviously, you can walk the police station. Uh, 1054. Yeah, he's got pistol license. Oh, yeah. He's part of the pistol club up here or here or wherever it is, the gun club here. Well, that's it. Yeah, 
Edam. But it's just like a slug gun. Yeah, it was like a pistol. Oh, yeah. I said, sure, it's worth something, isn't it? And he goes, no. He said, well, it's worth a few hundred bucks. He said, it's not worth it. I said, I'll take it. He goes, I can't do that either. He said, because it registers money and all that sort of stuff. You get caught with anything. Yeah, that's right. That's what I'm going to do. Thank you. 
Is that my journey? Is that your journey? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Can you do that well? Yeah. Yeah. No, they, they make it to the point where it yeah, costs you more than what it takes somewhere else. Yeah. 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 The idea of bringing well, the bones, you save a few dollars. You've got cranky at me. You say, oh, fuck it, you might as well just go to a mechanic. See you later, Trey. There's no point in trying to save a few dollars in there, see you're trying to buy some shit, I think. So the idea, the idea of bringing them away has to save money, <laughs> not just to spend money elsewhere. Yeah, yeah. I don't know. It's, it's an aim. Well, they make the fill down. Yeah. Sounds good. For the grazer? Yeah. Or what else? Yeah. Or just a brake line. Brake line? Brake line. Can you do that? Do you want me to do it? Just get one can of brake line. Brake line? Yeah. Maybe about eight bucks or something. Yeah. Okay. No, just one. What do you want? I get it. Give me one. Is it brake clean? It's brake clean. Brake clean. Yeah. Talking about brake clean. Is it? Okay. The young blokes are sniffing it or smoking it. You get high out of it. Brake clean. Brake clean. So I put some park clean at home, which I just put in a bottle and spray like you use like the degrader. And that's all. I don't know what's in that. And you spray it up that under the car, and it's like. Boom, it comes out, you walk through it, takes breath away. Really? Like this, yeah, like you yeah. feel it in the back of your neck, and it's like, oh, God, I don't know what's in that. That can't be They don't know to put it on a cigarette or something, but yeah, your brother was telling me, the young guy said he's worried on the crap, right? Yeah, they might be. Yeah. Oh, they were pretty good brains. They were pretty good brains. Oh, yeah. Yeah. So what it does, the bloody part, grease and shit on parts, by the window, by the deep grease. Bring all that parking. The deep reason I put it on, well, I waited then hose off. Put it hard on. Just spray it. Just wash it off. And then it dries. Even that's what it does. It's like oil and all that sort of stuff. The deep reason it's on. That's why it's hard to clean and brake clean. Because you use the wheels and the brake clean. You use 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 the brake clean. And you're going to turn up and you're going to break paper when you're going to get out there. 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 You're going to get out there.
They won't pay the way, they steal, they have got the drug time. You know, like the split system? Yeah. He pinched it out of, off the wall. <coughs> he took that, but he didn't take the condenser from the other side. So he, 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 he so never paid his way. rent, and then yeah. a month later he rang up Steve and said, if you could have, have a room. Yeah. <laughs> no way! He's in jail. He's got nowhere to do Jesus.
in a like, normal street. Yeah. And you drive down the street, you wouldn't ever know. No. Yeah. Where you can go into the housing areas, it's like, oh, yeah, all the cars on the lawn, you're watching the house, I'll make shit in it, pretend you're driving it. Or you drive down the hill, like, yeah, it's like, we've got the best out there, we've got the place, best art, people join. Four, four, five, seven, seven, eight. Good. Yeah, 
So in his roadway, he has to have his garage open and one car in the garage. Oh, yeah, that big bloody wall. Oh, 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 oh. The garage door shut, they can't put two cars, one's in the roadway and one's half a slip up. That's how close from the house to the road. My brother lives in the garage. From the garage, there was enough for the car which is here. So there was a good half for the front of the house. What, Sydney? Yeah. My dad's been born there, he knows Sydney from the back of his hand. Why? Why? I think she's changed a little bit. Yeah, Sydney. He's the same age as me, 52. You know it better, right? And he's like, um, he's playing his house at Erskine Park, same thing he bought it years and years ago. It's worth like nearly two million bucks now. That's here goes, I'll be looking at a, um, an apartment in Bali. Oh, yeah. yeah. Apparently, Bali's like 70 grand. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Nice big three bedroom place on the beach. Yeah. He goes, that's where that's my plan. He said, all I have to do is come back to Australia for three months a year or something. Yeah. Yeah. And then he can live there. And if you get crook, you come back to Australia. Yeah, that's right, yeah. <laughs> that's, yeah. He goes, so I'll sell me a place for two million bucks. Go buy that place for 60, 70 grand. Buy a car over there, so 100,000 bucks. He goes, I've got 1.9 million dollars to live on for the rest of my life. Living in Bali. Yeah. That's yeah. He goes, that's my plan. Like a king. Yeah, How much it, is the place in Bali? 80, 80 grand. And that's like a big fucking three bedroom studio apartment. He's still, got, got, one, beach. He's still got 1.9 million bucks. And probably 10 yeah. bucks, 10 bucks a bloody day. You can hire a, <laughs> hire a cleaner. Yeah. Cleaner. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. That's exactly and that's right. what he's going to do. Yeah. That's his plan. Then come back to Australia. You know, every yeah. few months. Stay for a couple of weeks. Yeah. Head back over. Didn't you say you got to stay three months? Over the year. Well, you've, got, you've got to be year. out of the country for oh, three so months and come back for two weeks, then come back for a month and then come back for two months and yeah. still come back and say, like you were going to his mum's place for a couple of months over Christmas, yeah, yeah. if he's retired, and then like obviously, because he's living there, yeah. he might go to America for a month on holidays. Yeah. You've just got to be out of, mm. out of Bali, out of Thailand yeah. for three months a year, three months of the year. Right. And then you can own the place and all that sort of stuff, you just can't live there. Mm. Definitely. Yeah, I definitely, yeah. I heard someone did something like that, but they kept their house and rented it. Yep, and but, they, but they, they kept the garage and they put made a little flat for themselves. Yeah, okay. So they come back and they live in that flat. Yep, yeah, well, there yeah. you go. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. That's, yeah, that's right, that little loop. So they got an income. Yep, that's right, that's yeah. paying, for all, paying for his life over there. Yeah, yeah. yeah. not a bad idea. Really. Yeah. As he said, he goes, I'll, I'll live like a king. He goes, got couple, almost a couple of million bucks. And obviously, then you invest that couple of million dollars yeah. and that turns yeah. over income and all yeah. that sort of business. Yeah. Yeah. But if you, know, if you retire, Living over there yeah. on your own, yeah. probably going to cost you ten bucks a day for food. Yeah. Yeah. So you get yourself a little house made, might cost you a hundred bucks a week. Yeah. Coming every couple of days to clean your place and oh. you know, make something to yeah. dinners for yeah. you or whatever. Yeah. And, cook your food. No, it's just said, yeah. Because here, like same thing. Because I'll sell me this place for two million bucks. You go go get an apartment somewhere. You pay one and a half million dollars for that. He says you got five hundred grand to live on for the rest of your life. Yeah. So that's not going to go far. No. Yeah. No. So that's you, you yeah. get a couple of more years, that's your plan. Yeah. Just to sell See everything you've got. Too? Yeah. Yeah. I, yeah. I met someone that had a similar, not quite a similar, but a stupid idea. He had a house in Sydney and he was about my age, you know, and he lived by his dick. He, everything oh, yeah. was about sex or sort of <laughs> Where are we going this whole <laughs> So his plan was to sell his house in Sydney and buy two houses in Thailand and 
Uh, one in the mountains, and he had a girl up there. Another one in the city, he had another girl there. Oh, that's right. <laughs> 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 going business trips. Between, yeah, <laughs> between them. Anyway, I said, because I knew his brother, and, and I said, oh, how did that work out on him? I said, oh, we saw him over at Cowrie, he was picking cherries. <laughs> he lost both houses. <laughs> <laughs> he didn't get too oh, far, right? Oh, Jesus. He lost both houses, probably yeah. both women. <laughs> yeah, he <laughs> both women, both houses. And now he's picking, cherries. picking cherries. Yeah. cherries. For $10 a box. I mean, like, yeah, yeah. he's been single for a long, long time, but he's been single so long that he, he wouldn't be able to have nah. a relationship. Nah. Like, yeah. It has to be like, you know, you go there within six months, he'll have some sort of some disease. He'll have the time of his fucking life doing it. What was that? He'll have the time of his oh, life yeah. doing it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, six months. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it doesn't look like Pete Sandler's coming with Jack, does it? Yeah. Uh, he's still only here by now. Yeah, he's normally here, but I think mean, he's got a church. I think mean, he's yeah, got a no, church. Yeah, no, he comes after church. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> a bad little church. We went to a christening there a few weeks ago where, where uh, Peter and Shane go. Shane goes too. Oh, and when you come out, all the ladies have got the morning tea ready and the, and the coffee and the tea and they have homemade cakes and biscuits. Oh, jeez, where's that? <laughs> That's at that church on the hill there, Trinity. It sounds real good except for the church part. <laughs> <laughs> I said, I, said, I, said, I, said, I might come to church here with you and look forward to a nice morning tea. So I'm in church, No, no, it's, uh, it's not Catholic, but they're sort of related. They're the Church of England. Is it? That's the church that was the first one. But Shane yeah. says they sort of do the same thing as us Catholics. Yeah, you know, uh, the Holy I, Communion I, and that. I, I was just under the impression uh, that that was a, a Catholic, but it could be a church. Of yeah, no, it's not. Nah. But it's apparently the first church west of the mountains. Yeah, it? yeah, it was, yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Right up on the hill. Holy, eh? Holy Trinity. Yeah. Oh, what's it called? Holy Trinity. Yeah, the Holy yeah. Trinity. I mean, nice. They had trouble trying to find a pastor. They had, a, had one on loan from out west that used to come. Yeah. <laughs> one on loan? <laughs> yeah, on loan, yeah. They bring him. <laughs> and they've got the big house there, you know, um, in the church. Day. And it's <coughs> empty. Yeah. Fly, fly. Just sits empty, going away. <laughs> so, for, for, like for, a three-bedroom house just sitting there empty because there's no vicar. Yep. So they, they should either rent it out, get some income, you know. Yeah, problem with that, but then they'll, they'll rent it out with a six month lease. The next week they'll find someone that's yeah. like, Yeah, we're going to put you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, yeah. But yeah, just not enough, no, no one around to fill no, the shoes. Not parishioners. No, yeah. there's hardly any parishioners. Yeah. That's no, sad, eh? Hey? And what happens when all these ones that are there die out? There'll be no one going. Yeah. There's no new blood coming in, you know. It's all old people, you know, young ones. No, I've been to a lot of people. 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 And the people are nice. Yeah. That's why Shane goes. He said, "Oh, people call me by my name, you know." Well, he goes to St. Michael and John's, and no one knows no, him. No, no. <laughs> so I go there, and I feel like family. You know. Although I, 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 I get called up a lot when I get there. <laughs> you do, St. Michael and John. Yeah, you know a lot of people from that house. Yeah. I went to school with them. Yeah. Yeah. I went to school, yeah. see. Yep. I, I went to Catholic school. Went to Kenny, which is another Catholic school. And I also went to the demonstration school, which is that Baptist, yeah, the St. Paul uh, public school. Yeah, in public school. I went there too. So I virtually knew every bugger that was growing up. Yeah. yeah. Um, and they still all try to talk to me, and there's not one woman in the monks that I want to talk to. <laughs> <laughs>
I've seen a good thing on Facebook the other day. They had all these, <coughs> had all these half naked women all sitting around in a big group photo. And it said, uh, the, the, um, all, your, all your high school French. <laughs> All your high school dreams that you wanted to hook up with are now available. That's what I think he's doing. Got a lot of money. You laugh at some of the bloody All the girls you wanted to hook up with that high school are now available. <laughs> And it's just that after you get to a certain age, you just look at them and say, oh, 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 what was I looking at there? Yeah. Oh, that's age though, isn't it? Hey? That's age. Yeah. Changes your body shape. Some of them still look all right though. I think I might have saved it. I, I tell you what, there some are them a kept their, Some uh, of them uh, kept their flat tummies and that, maybe yeah. they didn't have kids, you know. Uh, well, a few of them sort of look all right. right. <laughs> yeah, with them because Christ, they've got a different nature to the bloke. Yeah. You can understand that. Yeah, I, you know, I reckon their nature is just very fiery for some reason or other. What's fiery? Women's nature. Women? Yeah. They are, they're cranky bugs. Yeah. So I'm are. married to one, I've been married for 60 years, yeah. and she's still cranky. Yeah, she's your childhood sweetheart, eh? Yeah, you? I know. But still. Yeah, but she's got to put up with it. She has got a lot to put up with, that's true. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I got a sister today who's always cranky. She's got mental health problems. Oh, has she? Yeah, having she wants to, want to kill me. She wants to kill me every freaking day. Well, I, I can understand that. <laughs> I, can, I can't even do anything wrong to her. She's just. Sometimes, half of the time, she doesn't take her medication half of the time. Oh, well, that's a different. And her eyes go really, really dark brown, and it's just, yeah, I get, oh, yeah. I, like I, 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 get I get shaky in my <laughs> fucking boots. She's by the devil. <laughs> I, remember well, well, that an exorcism. I remember I was watching Mr. Bean, yeah. and, and he's over in America, yeah. and this bloke like says, are you on any yeah. medication? Oh, I think it would help. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I think it would help. And the thing is, she, she, the thing is, she doesn't like churches. The thing is, she, she, yeah. Yeah. I got the church when I was fuck when I was six when I got baptized uh, from oh you've been a couple of times yeah <laughs> back, back, back at Jesus, Jesus Christ I used, to have, I used to have to go right through up until I was around about 12 and then I bothered I started using to sneak away yeah <laughs> yeah yeah so yeah I'm, I need to watch out for my sister she's one of them again. Yeah, even she snapped at my dad and mum. She snapped at the parents uh, for no reason. She's. You know, yeah. you're talking about this beneficiary of father's. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <coughs> Steve's. Yeah. Well, a couple of people that were playing, uh, living with him, they all got invited to go to Sydney with Steve. Eh? And that young girl was telling me what a nice place he had. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I think he had like on the water and you could go down to the jetty and take the boat out. Yeah. Yeah. I don't know, people well, people have nice houses, but it doesn't matter, does it? I mean I've got a nice house too. Yeah. So I wonder if um Steve said he's got an eye on some place but he's waiting for it to come up for sale. Has he? That was like nearly a year ago. Oh okay. Straight from ten. Yeah. Pretty fit for his age, isn't he? Yeah, he goes to the gym. He goes to the gym, he swims, the bloody, he swims in the Sydney Harbour. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, he's a good bloke. Very good man. He is. Yeah. It's nice to have friends like that, though, isn't it? Yeah, that's sort of... <coughs> like, you know, I have friends, you know. Yeah, it's just... Yeah, I should just call in there one day and come and have a cup of coffee with you. Know?
in the ring. Yeah. Yeah, he did a really job. He did a 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 job. He one of his houses, he was up on the bloody roof and he fell off. Oh, yeah. You know. I think I did a lot of overtime all for free. I think I'm going to get the little traffic. Church doing other work, eh? Yeah. It didn't happen. Right, I'm out. Um, if you get the stuff this week, I'll be releasing yeah. free next Saturday. Oh, yeah. If you yeah. want to get it all, and we'll do it Saturday, Sunday afternoon. Yeah. After we finish here on Sunday or something. Oh, yeah, yeah. Sound complete? Ah, uh, two o'clock. I got band practice though, so. Oh, okay. Um, what about the following Saturday afternoon? Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Sounds like a plan. Yeah. yeah. So yeah. not this Saturday, coming but the, the following. next Saturday. Yeah. yeah. I think that'd be right. Let's have a yeah. call during that week. Call, yeah. Just give me a call and yeah. sort of make sure nothing's popped up and all that yeah. sort of shit. So. Yeah. Thanks, Troy. Too easy. Good on you, mate. Done. All right. So talk to you. See yeah. you, Troy. Thanks, buddy. Yeah. Oh, you dropped the oil out of it. It's a new one. I do. It goes up and down. 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 And I did get a phone call from them. <laughs> they wanted the sign writing done. Yeah, right. I was like, oh no, I'm not a sign writer. <laughs> sign payment. <coughs> you because you were saying that. Well, apparently you can, yeah, under five grand and you don't need a license. Yeah. yeah. That's what they were handy man told me at the rain and lawn function box was using it. There's places like, you know, the real estate people and all that. Yeah, definitely. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, I'm pretty, I'm pretty good. Oh no, I'm draining on because I've got a few rentals going. Yeah, yeah. A lot of, a lot of, a lot of those things are short notice. Yeah, yeah. I can't handle like, I need to tell my next week. Yeah. Whereas I sort of, a lot of times I'm booked out. But I just like working for Steve, I just like that. Yeah. 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 Yeah
they came about eight o'clock in the uh, in the morning. Eight o'clock in the morning, they started to bring all the big machinery out, and yeah, that actually is a lot weird. So right now, I'll see you guys back on the dragons down. Until then, I hopefully the power's back on so I can charge both cameras. So I'll see you guys then. Till then, I'll see you guys back on the dragons then. Well, uh, can't go home. They actually put in a couple of power poles in, and literally, yeah. They are literally, literally pulling power poles in and they block both entrance and I can't even get in to get home. And it is only 22 minutes, 23 minutes past 12 in the afternoon. I'm supposed to get home and have lunch. But, no, nah, they actually blocked both kind of fucking entrance hopefully my dad gets back hopefully so hopefully it, it, that, it's gonna be all good right now um, sorry about Patrick and the others getting, uh, getting in the way of the camera <laughs> that's the funny thing about it. they don't know if the camera was on or not is they don't use the JVC cameras. I only use the JVC cameras to film archery, but no. They had to stay in the way. <laughs> oh, well. So, when they are finished, I don't know when they're going to be finished because I am friggin' starving. I am hungry. So, I should have brought my camera charger to stay over our archery. So, yeah. This actually sucks. So, yeah. But right now, yeah, one of the bigger and one of the heavy machinery is next to me. That's why you can hear the noise. Yeah, this is kind of ridiculous. Don't know why they doing it today, but uh. Even my dad's gonna be pissed because I don't know where he is. Um, I might give my dad a call. To see how he's going. Hey dad, uh, I can't get home. They, they blocked both entrance. They, they block both entrance, dad. Dad, I'm I'm not at the I'm not the, at the house at all. I'm I'm at the. Right yeah. Because when I got back they they blocked both entrance. <sighs> Alright dad. Alright dad. See ya. Bye. My phone's not 
um, working properly. Look at the big corner screen of the phone, it's cracked. So that's why I can't put it on full speaker or anything because the phone's fucked. <laughs> so I'm gonna follow my dad home. I don't know where he is, but he's gonna lead me home. But if they say no, go on the other side, we have to wait it out. So, ah, uh, this is one pain in the friggin' ass. Why are they doing it today? Ah, uh, it's got a really pain in the ass. Pain in the proverbial. Ah, uh, oh well. And I broke one of my arrows um, while the. Oh, fucking hell. While the bull heads weighed the arrow down and it hit the wood about 40 meters. Um, I think this bow's not ready for 40 meters yet. Tried to. Got 114 out of the 40 meters, but. Yeah, it's not ready yet. So I'm going to wait for my dad so he can leave me home. Oh, don't fly the kite there. Uh, <laughs> are they are they flying a kite? So, don't know when they they're going to be done. So, <laughs> I'm going to just wait for my dad and just. It's quite fucked. It is just. I'm not really happy about this. It, get to the farm, then live on something proper, except rentals. Yeah, that's what my dad. Uh, that's why I told my dad. No more renting. Uh, t time to move to our um, place and live there. And that, that's why I said to my dad. The thing that why I said about my sister has mental health problems. She does. Half the time, and she doesn't have her medication, and she goes psycho. Believe me, it, it scares the hell out of me, and my heart goes. 200 kilometers an hour, scared. Oh, I'm, I'm not joking. So, ah, oh, fuck's sake. It's one of those things where I'm stuck. And let me. Uh, where's dad? Oh, fucking hell. All right, let me show you about the roadworks. Um, it actually sucks. There, they're working on the power poles, and fuck me, this is absolutely fucking stressful. Um, chocolate cake while well, I made it yesterday <laughs> tasted really good. <laughs> My family had a piece and I did not feel like to have chocolate right now because it makes me sneeze and stomach pains. So, yeah, the thing is about my sister, she does not calm down. She does not have her medications half of the time and half the time she doesn't, ha she doesn't want to have her medication and she's... Yeah, luckily I don't have mental health, and I'm really sociable, but... Yeah, it's the thing about my sister. <laughs> Far out. So, right now, it's gonna be a waiting game. What the fuck are they doing anyway? 
This is taking the hole off and then they're trying to put one power pole in. Are you fucking serious? <sighs> oh well. So right now my dad's gotta come back. He'll show me the path to get back home. And then yeah. This is one fucked day. Excuse the bad French, but yeah, I really don't like it. So right now, I'll see you guys probably in the afternoon. Wherever they finished and turned the power back on, I'll let the camera and the battery charge and then do so. So I'll see you guys probably about, <laughs> I don't fucking know about, three to four o'clock in the afternoon so I'll see you guys then okay the power is finally back on and they've been working on the power lines for the whole day since eight o'clock in the morning to now and my hair is really messy right now because I've been out in the garage uh, so yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and I hope you guys loved it. It's been a, absolutely a good day, but a weird one because they blocked both ends of the street. Oh my freaking god, I was trying to come home, and the lady said detour. How the hell are I detour if both ends are being blocked? That is a pain in the ass. So, yeah, I'm sorry about my friend Patrick and the others that are standing in front of the camera. They don't know if the camera's on or not. So, fuck. So, right now, yeah, I turned on the heat mat. I did not even turn on the light for the boys. They are staying asleep. So yeah, so I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you enjoyed this video, please leave a like, subscribe, and comment. Until then, uh, it was the time anyway. Yeah, they're freaking hell, is it? They finished. They finished about 16:34, and it's now 6:30. 16:36. Uh, that is 4:36 and a half, and then holy shit. Oh well. So, yeah. Plus, I am nearly to the point where I can split my engine and fix the problem. And then rebuild it. And then put it back on the car. And that's brilliant. That is good. That is awesome <laughs> so yeah today's been absolutely good I absolutely enjoyed it today and I actually did I stayed there since I started <sighs> far out started at 8 o'clock and there's nothing wrong with the, um, there's nothing wrong with the, um, generator. It's the, um, coffee van fuses. Low voltage. Friggin' Chinese voltage. Friggin' hell. So, I'll see you guys next time. Till then, I'll see you guys tomorrow for more archery. Till then, I'm gonna throw this shit in the wash before my mum finds out I got grease on it because she doesn't like white shirts with grease. She'd rather see me nice and neat and tidy, not greasy. So, did I get any grease on my Viking shirt? No, I didn't. Oh, that's good. Oh, wait. Just a little bit right there. But I can I can clean up. 
So, I'll see you guys next time. Till then, peace for now, and see you guys about tomorrow. Ah, oh, tomorrow's Monday. Yeah, tomorrow Monday. So, yeah, today I forgot my license, so tomorrow I won't forget my license or the membership card. So, I'll see you guys next time. Till then, peace from now. Get over here!